Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to understand names of the protocol data unit, which is in short, it is also called as PDU. The concepts of IP address and the first row, uh, all the fields of the first row of the IP header, IPv4 header has already been discussed in our previous video. If you haven't watched that video, please watch that video and come back here. And uh, uh, before going into the second row, so the concept that we are going to discuss in this video and the next three to four videos are very important for you to understand what we are going to discuss uh, 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 to discuss about the details of the fields in the second row of the IPv header. So uh, in this video we will try to understand about uh, a protocol data unit. So what is meant by protocol data unit? A protocol data unit PDU is a group of information added by each layer. So at each and every layer the content that is being added so that unit of content is what we call it as that unit of data is what we call it as a protocol data unit and each at each layer it is having each at each layer that protocol data unit will have its own names. So what are those names and uh, uh, that we will try to understand. Uh, so as we have discussed about this point and uh, again we will try to understand this uh, for better understanding. Uh, so here the message that we want to transfer at the application layer the the data the the data that we want to transfer at the application layer is what we call it as so this is the protocol data unit that this is the unit of data that needs to be transferred from application layer to its lowest layer it is transport layer so uh, that uh, that unit of data this PDU is, is what is, is what we call it as message in application layer so in application layer it is called as message or data so this is the data this is the original data that needs to be transferred so this message will be forwarded to the transport layer and to this message the transport header will get added and uh, the combination of this message and the transport header is the protocol data unit of the transport layer which is called as segment so it is called as segment or it is also called as datagram datagram so it depends on the protocol that is being used in the transport layer if the protocol is, that is being used is tcp then it is called as segment if it is udp it is called as datagram so uh, don't go deeper about this tcp and udp so just try to remember so we are going to discuss in detail about these concepts of uh, tcp and udp in our later layer which is transport layer so uh, at this point of time we will consider only segment we we don't talk about datagram we don't uh, we don't talk about datagram so just the datagram the protocol data unit in the transport layer is called as a segment and coming to the lower layer which is below the uh, transport layer network layer so here to this payload to this payload the network header will also get added so here this network header is what we call it as ip so if it is version 4 means version 4 otherwise it is version 6 so this header uh, will get added to the payload uh, or to the segment to this this uh, network layer header will get added uh, will get added so this is what we call it as protocol data unit so this protocol data unit in network layer is what we call it as packet this is what we call it as packet and this payload will be transferred to the data link layers here so this payload has been transferred to the data link layer to that the data link layer header and the data link layer tail is getting added so this uh, the name of the pdu at this layer is what we call it as it is it is called as frame it is called as frame okay and uh, now now uh, that uh, this entire data this entire protocol data unit will be transferred to the physical layer here it is called as bits as we have discussed that the raw bits will get transferred into the physical layer so it is called as 
bits so these are the names that are very important to, to remember so because as we are going to discuss the uh, uh, further concepts there we are going to talk so there we are going to use this terminology called segment so packet frame uh, frame we have we have already used to use it with so whenever i say packet this is the visualization that you need to have whenever i say frame this is the visualization that you need to have segment this is what we call it as message or data so this is how uh, this is what the message or data means okay this kind of visualization is very important to understand hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching